Hey guys, Derek with the Survivalists. Um, I'm actually going to be doing some bow practice. Got my nice compound bow here. Got the uh, five arrow quiver. I only had three arrows on it. Nice addition to it. It is a left hand shooter. Show you the whole thing. Unfortunately, I did have to take the sight off and the arrow holder off to put that on, but definitely well worth it. Um, I also did get a case for it for to you know in case I go out hunting or you know to a range or whatever but I will actually be doing some shooting with it today figure this nice out I'm in a t-shirt it's about 60 degrees out so yeah let's get to it So you want to knock it, make sure everything stays on right. Uh. As you can see I do have practice arrows so they're not going to stick too well. But yeah, hitting the tree. Nice. Uh, these are actually carbon arrows, so a little bit stronger, a little bit lighter, easy to use. This is uh, in, isn't the highest powered bow. There, that way you guys can kind of see. Uh, one thing you want to do is practice your uh, settings. You can see right here, right there, one right there. One right there and right there so it's kind of all over the place oh mark right there too so yeah what you want to practice make sure you're getting your marks all the time got some of these actually you know what Set that up. And yes, these things do get a little heavy. My left arm is getting a little tired out, but it comes with the territory, that's why you practice, built up your strength. Alright, let's see if I can actually get this stuck in it and how well it'll stick. There we go. See, this is why you want to have a few arrows so that way you're not going out and constantly getting the one you just shot. Probably can't see it, but it's actually sticking in there good. Good grouping, good grouping. One more shot. See how well I do. Give my arm a little rest. It does give you a workout. Uh, you can't really see me, but 
hopefully you can hear me and see that. Yeah, one of the best things is sit there and take your time, make sure you're getting your aim. Full drop back. That one's a little off. Next up, getting it hung up. Yeah, you can see this one right here, here, and here. Show you how uh, deep they go through. Yeah, you can see some of them anywhere from six inches to a foot through. So definitely good penetration, especially on uh, just over half inch, I say, of wood. So you know you're getting the power. Best part is getting those out. <sighs> e. Probably don't want to do that, but well, that's me practicing a little bit, and I will see you guys on the other side. Hope you guys click like, subscribe, and I'll keep you posted.